in my team at the moment, I'm very, very lucky. I've got kind of in-country leads for each of the hubs we look after. When I bring that team together, though, like you've described, I've got a bunch of different people, loads of diversity, gender, age, ethnicity, religion, you know, you name it. We, we actually are a very, very diverse team. I actually think that is our strength because in my experience, people who have nothing in common tend to get on better in building working relationships faster because you're genuinely interested about that person. You're genuinely interested in learning a little bit more about their world and themselves. And then I'm a great believer in you've got to have fun at work. Like yeah. if you're coming into work and you're not having fun or smiling or laughing or feeling good about it, it's not, you're not in the right place. And when I bring people into my team, it's always about, are you going to be a good fit for the team? And are you going to bring that kind of positivity and energy and humor as well as, are you absolutely brilliant at what you do? And we're all very different. You know, we've all got different personalities, but when we go on to calls, it's genuinely, the first five, 10 minutes is always about, you know, the weather in India is super hot right now. How are you all <laughs> getting on? Is everything okay? So, so, you know, you're able to have those kind of light, humorous, human conversations, which almost sets the tone of, remember, at the end of the day, we're all just people and we're not perfect. So when you then have to have those kind of tough conversations about we're not on track, we're red, we're, we're behind on our efficiency targets, we've got a ton of attrition, people come at those with more empathy. So yes. I I think there's huge, huge, huge strength in having a high level, di- a high level of diversity within your team. 